thumbnail. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yo, what's up everyone? This is Johnny or The Shredded Pork, but please just call me Johnny because The Shredded Pork is actually sounding kind of weird to me right now. <laughs> uh, anyways, guys, today is a special day for me and I hope you guys are all having a great day too, but today is about me. Today marks my one year fitness journey and I gotta say I'm extremely proud of myself for being able to make it through a year, not all 365 days, but just remaining consistent. I didn't know what to really talk about in this video because I didn't want to just ramble about everything I did in my fitness journey and how I got through it because I don't think I'd be addressing anything. But I did ask a friend of mine, his name is Adu, shout outs to Adu. He gave me a series of questions to think about uh, because these questions were not just from my perspective, but rather from someone else who wasn't like a gym bro or into calisthenics like I am. So his first question is, how do you find motivation to go to the gym? And I realized that, wow, that's, that's a pretty difficult question to answer. But after some time and thinking about it, I realized it's two things. So the first one is setting realistic goals. When I first started my fitness journey, I didn't know where to go, what to do. I, I was just in the calisthenics. So I just tried to remember that. And I wanted to do this one thing, this one move, and it's called a muscle up. And I I'm pretty sure a lot of you know what it is, but it's when there's a pull up bar and then like you pull yourself like this and over the bar and then you push up like that and you go back down and you just go back up again and yeah so that, that was probably a really bad explanation I'll probably attach a clip that was all I was focused on I was I was obsessed with trying to learn the muscle up that I started taking every step necessary to get there so in order for me to get the muscle up I would have to develop stronger back muscles do pull-ups like a lot almost every day and see very incremental progress and then from there I just kept consuming more knowledge and different practices and different exercises and I just kept trying things that was my motivation but eventually I mastered that muscle up and I didn't really have a motivation to keep going and after mastering the muscle up and getting stronger seeing progress in my body it wasn't the motivation that really took me further. So to me, motivation is like setting a goal and a target. But what you need to do to meet that is going to take discipline. And I think discipline was what kept me going to the gym. Knowing that in order for me to reach a goal, which was also changing my body, you know, just getting more tone or building more muscles and losing more weight, I have to continue to work out and after a while it just became a habit and you know anytime I had a downtime or anytime I just didn't feel like going I just went anyways because it became routine and that was where discipline played a key role in that question number two did you do cardio no I didn't I mean you really don't have to but it does help and I, as much as I want to add cardio to my routine uh, and exercise, it's just really hard to run. Uh, my, I have a bad knee and you know, if, if you just don't feel good doing something, don't force yourself to do it. If you feel good and you enjoy it, do it. But otherwise, if you keep making yourself do something you don't like, chances are you're going to quit. So I did not do cardio and you don't have to either. Question number three, what is your workout routine? So this is a little difficult to answer as well, but I'm gonna do my best to summarize this. So I used to do PPL splits, which is push-pull legs, but now I'm kind of in a phase where I'm like adapting. Oh my gosh, I'm doing the Sage Resurrection move. <laughs> if you play Valorant, you know what that is. Anyways, I'm at a phase where I kind of do all three body parts top bottom core and basically I know uh, which muscle groups that I need to work on next because I can tell which muscle groups aren't ready to be worked on and probably require a little bit more time to recover 
but every now and then I would fall back to PPL uh, just in case I need to reset and during PPL I would hit the compounds first and then I'd go into isolations and then finish off with core and that's pretty much my workout routine. Question number four, how often do you work out? A lot of people will probably disagree with me but I'm a fan of working out as much as possible, as high frequency as possible. At one point I was doing six days a week. Just kidding, at one point I had a non-stop streak of maybe almost two months and honestly what I go by for workout frequency and how often is whether or not your body feels tired. Um, if you just don't feel good, then don't work out. If you feel okay, why not? And that's pretty much what determines how often I go to the gym. Question number five, do you take supplements? Yes, I did. In the first half of my fitness journey, uh, the first half of the year, and then I stopped taking them. Why? Well, it was due to because I started feeling sick. So the reason is I took a ton of protein powder each day. I was maybe consuming like three to four scoops and a lot of creatine pills, I think five grams, I don't know. It, it was like two capsules and they're thick. They're like the size of my thumb. And it was, uh, I was really good at swallowing it. And my wife found that, con <laughs> And my wife thought that was concerning. Anyways, do I take supplements? No. Can you take supplements? Yeah. And ever since I stopped taking it, I can't tell if it will make a difference taking it and not taking it. So I'm gonna end this video with those five questions and I hope that I provided some sort of valuable information that you can use for yourself and to help you along your fitness journey. It's only been a year for me and I know some of y'all have gone through this a lot longer than I have or maybe you're just getting started. Regardless, don't give up, keep going, and I'm right there with you. Fitness, yeah.